so delighted to share with you our story for today and it is called summer fruits by constance newman illustrated by chiara fiorentino look we have a visitor here and he is grandpa grandpa is selling fruits in the market can you name all the fruits he sell banana blueberry pineapple <gasps> look what color is the pineapple it's yellow right do you know that outside of a pineapple is covered with brown scales or spines with green leaves on the top oh that is very interesting right hmm. okay how about this one oranges and this grapes how about them watermelon wow you are a good reader you name all of these fruits are you ready to read this book yeah! let's get started summer fruits by constance newman illustrated by tiara fiorentino look at all the colors look at all the fruits wow there are tons of fruits here and these children are so happy to eat these yummy fruits. Can you name all of these fruits and tell me their colors? Hair? Yes, what color are they? Yellow. Correct. How about strawberries? What color are strawberries? red good how about blueberries what color are blueberries blue good how about grapes what color are grapes they are purple very good Ready. how about bananas what color are they yellow how about this watermelons what color are they they are green but do you know that inside they are red and how about kiwi what color are they they are green inside and brown outside very good how about pineapples yes they are yellow inside and brown outside now let's mix them all together wow it looks cool Ta-da! What did they make? They made a fruit salad. Do you like fruit salad? I know you like. That is our story for yeah! Hi mommies and welcome to our one, two, three tips for parents. Today I'm gonna share with you our two different kinds of activities with your kiddos. For tip number one, do coloring, cutting, and singing with your kids. Here's how we do it. And for tip number two, play Say It Slowly game with your kids. First, place 
all the fruits and vegetables picture cards in front of your children and then ask them to listen very carefully while you are talking like a nearly broken robot for example you chose carrot and just say carrot and for tip number three ask this question what word am i saying then ask them to get or to give you the corresponding picture cards and that's it and that's all for today bye